This question is clearly about unit conversion, and I don't take chances with that stuff. There might be easy ways to do it and just kind of, you know, do it instinctively, but I'm always afraid of it. So I use this chart method. Uh, you can watch my lesson on that. I highly recommend it. And it just involves finding some, some rates and going with it. So uh, a distance of 354 furlongs, so 354 furlongs is equivalent to how many feet? So that's X feet. Uh, so you want to put a, a unit on each side. And so in this case, this rate is kind of like the question itself. But even still, I've got a bunch of rates now in the parentheses there. So let's just add those in as well. And as I do, I want to cross off a unit by having the same unit on both sides. So when I do one furlong is equal to 220 yards, I'm going to put the furlongs on the other side, kind of write it in reverse. So that way I can cross out the furlongs. And then the same thing with the yards. One yard is three feet. So yards are gone, yards are gone, and look at that. Feet are also gone, that's how I know I'm done. And now you multiply down the list, okay? So on the right side, it's easy. It's just X times one times one. And on the left side, we're just gonna get a calculator and do 354 times 220 times three. And we get some huge number that is clearly choice D, but I will write it out anyway, done. So that's it. Now, some of you, yeah, well, I could just know to multiply. It's obvious. Okay, good for you, but it's not always obvious. And a lot of the times that you think it's obvious, it's not obvious and you don't know it and you make a mistake. And so what the chart method does for me is I don't have to worry about whether it's obvious. I don't have to worry about accidentally doing it wrong. I can just see it and it's obvious because it's on the page. It's obvious because I've shown the work. That's the difference. You could think something's obvious in your head, but until you see it, you really don't know. And some of you don't get that. And that's why you lose points on careless mistakes. This is not a place to ever lose points.